This is an adult male patient who presented with hypertension. Renal Doppler was performed which turned out to be normal. Color Doppler ultrasound showed no significant abnormalities in the renal arteries indicating normal blood flow patterns and absence of any stenosis or obstruction. The left renal artery shows an RI of 0.48 and a PSV of 36 which is normal. The measurements of renal resistive index range from 0.48 to 0.51 which falls within the upper limit of the normal range. The peak systolic velocity in both renal arteries appears to be normal. Both renal arteries measured 0.7 cm in diameter which is normal. The waveform of the renal arteries on spectral Doppler also appears normal. Both renal arteries show a triphasic pattern with three phases, a systolic phase, a diastolic phase and an end-diastolic phase. The segmental arteries also show a triphasic pattern which is normal in this patient. The peak systolic velocity in the segmental arteries is slightly lower than that in the renal arteries. The peak systolic velocity in both segmental arteries appears to be in the range of 26 to 30 centimeters per second and an RI of around 0.45. This, these values are totally normal. The systolic upstroke in the renal arteries is sharp and well defined. Second part of the diastolic phase shows a rapid deceleration during diastole resulting in a distinct diastolic phase with continuous flow during diastole. The third phase is the end diastolic phase where it occurs just before the start of the next systolic phase and is the last component of the waveform represented by a small positive deflection. The end diastolic phase represents the lowest velocity of blood flow during the cardiac cycle in the renal arteries.